on guys, Eric here, driverlineup.com, world's okay steering wheel holder and world's okay TNT trainee. Oh yeah. I'm trying not to say student. For those of you who don't know, you're a student in PSD. You're not a student in TNT, you're a trainee. That's trainee in, in training, I believe is what TNT stands for. But anyway, uh, apprentice, whatever you want to call it, world's okayest for sure. <laughs> uh, it's Captain Dave here. And hey he may have a YouTube channel pretty soon, you guys. Uh, he'll probably give you an update on that soon. He's got other things he's focusing on right now, but certainly has been a topic of conversation. Anyway, uh, we're sitting here, Bobtail, at a truck stop that is not on our route and was not a part of our trip plan and um, that we do not want to be at. <laughs> Why is that? We're not getting miles. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're not making money. And we have to, we had to drive miles that don't count for his TNT and don't count for my pay. Um, we had an amazing drop and hook at our 90, which is our in customer, our drop off customer this morning. Uh, we got there five o'clock this morning, mm -hmm. and. Uh, super fast and we were in and out of there with paperwork and everything in probably 15 minutes I think at, at most but where we got the empty trailers which was right outside the guard shack the trailer that looked to me to be the only prime trailer there uh, its reefer wouldn't start so we had to come to carrier fortunately it's not yesterday because if it was yesterday I don't think we'd be getting to the load that we were going to uh, because Thanksgiving Day, I don't believe this carrier was open. Doesn't mean they couldn't send, possibly send, a, you know, out of out or non-business hour on-call tech to us. That's possible, but it probably would have taken a lot more time and been more difficult yesterday to get this dealt with. So, yeah, in his first 24 hours of TNT. We're already taking a broken trailer to get fixed before we can go get our next load. So, welcome to trucking, huh? It's all learning experience, right? Yep. Yeah, and we were just talking about it. Um, you know, I, I talk about this all the time on the channel about how you have to be mentally, what would be the right word? Um, Ready for anything, anything to happen. Yeah, you, you have to be uh, prepared for all flexible. types of flexible yes mental flexibility for sure um, because shit is going to go sideways and it's completely out of your control that reefer so it wouldn't pass its pre-trip because it couldn't start the code was a uh, starter sent a uh, starter uh, circuit something like that so the reefer would come on but it just wouldn't the engine wouldn't start up um, and Obviously, we can't go drop that off at our next drop and hook, so it has to be fixed, and that's not a part of the plan, and, and that's going to happen. And, you know, it's a good thing that we're getting it fixed so that some other driver doesn't get a broken trailer dumped on them. Um, but it's just, you got to be able to roll with that, you know, it's, it's just the name of the game. Um, and he's had a pretty good attitude about it. I got a pretty good attitude about it because it just is what it is. So we're still, the guy over there told us it was only going to be about an hour for him to have it fixed. We'll have no problem getting our next load and then, uh, then go park again for tonight. It's kind of weird for me stopping for 10 hour breaks. That is, that's a new concept for me. <laughs> it feels to me like we're running very slow as a truck right now. Um, but we're, we're still getting it done. He he drove he's probably 150 miles so far. Yeah. Um, and so that was his first actual 150 into TNT. But I think that puts us at 350-ish on his TNT. It'll probably be over 500 miles by the time we park today. Well over 500 total for his TNT. So the first 24 hours. But I thought you said these miles don't count. These don't. Right. Yeah. Uh, the, just the up to here. Okay. Just the, when we made that turn. Uh -huh. So that would have been, I think, 20 miles or so. Okay. So that 20 won't count. Gotcha. But when we get back on our route, going back to the 01, I think we'll probably be over a little over 500 total for him. Um, 
on his first 24 hours. Obviously, as we get cooking on things, we want that to be higher, you know, but it's progress. Absolutely. And uh, pro some progress is better than no progress. So on the first drive, you know, how, how did that feel? Uh, how's the truck feel? The truck feels great. Uh, you know, it's my first time to ever be behind the wheel in a Peterbilt. And, uh, you know, what they say about it is, is, is true. It's a smooth ride as composed to the, compared to the uh, Freightliner. So I'm loving uh, driving this truck. It's, it's, uh, it's awesome. And uh, just came up the highway. It was a real easy drive. There wasn't a lot of traffic. So, you know, it was a great day to, to get uh, integrated into the, the drive. And Eric's been great. I think, uh, we're just uh, committed that we're going to enjoy the journey, and, and we are. So right now, we're just waiting on the the uh, trailer to get done, and then we'll be back on the road. Yep. So uh, this is a good this is a good truck to drive. <laughs> um, actually, I've been really really blessed in that all three of my trucks. You longtime subscribers know we've, we've I've had my problems, but again, that's trucking. Every truck is going to eventually need some special attention. Um, but I've been really blessed to have three good trucks that drove really well. I don't miss that freight ladder, <laughs> especially when we go into the Peterbilt, but yeah, he's so far so good. So, uh, we're going to pick up this load today. That's going down to Texas and, uh, Walmart, New Caney. A lot of you guys will be familiar with that Walmart. And, uh, from there, we're going to try and start working our way to Florida because he's got to get his... Florida CDL or, or get to get his test results turned into Florida to actually get his CDL issued. And while he has a little bit of time, uh, we don't want to push it because Christmas is coming and he doesn't want to be trying to get in the DMV right before Christmas. So we're just going to go try to get it out of the way right now. So, uh, yeah, we're on the, on the path to get to Florida and figure out where we go from there. Uh, but outside of that, everything's good. Hopefully this trailer gets fixed and we'll be on our way. Anything else? Nope. Good to see you guys. Have a great day. All right. If you have any if you have any questions about uh, TNT, he's watching the comments down below too. And he's going to be on the channel for the next two months. So if you have any questions about his experience in uh, PSD and TNT coming through Prime, uh, feel free to ask. If he doesn't see it, I'll, I'll make sure that he does if I see it. Um, and you know, want, feel free to interact with him just as much as me with any questions you might have. So, all right, guys, appreciate it. Thank you so much. Be safe out there. Make good decisions. Always drive, thrive. We'll talk with you guys soon.